With much devotion and faith, thousands of Christians from the Holy Land gathered in Haifa on Sunday, May 7 to attend the traditional procession of the Virgin's Climb to Mount Carmel, an occasion that has attracted Christians of various rites, cities, and generations of the Holy Land who witnessed the presence of several bishops and many priests and religious. This procession is an event that we citizens of Haifa anticipate. In the second or third Sunday after Easter, we used to participate in this procession as children. Ever since I was a child, I have participated in it with the parish or the scouts. Ero sempre presente in chiesa, quindi andavo con la chiesa o con lo scouts. The origin of this religious manifestation dates back to 1919, after the end of the First World War. Haifa was exposed to many bombings because during the war it was the only harbor for this part of the Middle East. Thank God nothing happened during the war. In thanksgiving to the Virgin Mary and above all to the Lord, the statue was moved to a church up here, its original seat. So, in gratitude for this blessing, they decided to celebrate this famous climbing of all the faithful with Our Lady to Mount Carmel. In conoscimento di questa grazia, si celebri questa famosa salita della Madonna e di tutti i fedeli al Monte Carmelo. The nearly three-hour walk was animated by the percussion of the scouts, by the rosary prayer and other Marian hymns. Throughout the trip, the wagon carrying the Virgin was transported by the crowd. People were very happy, as you could see, because for Christians the procession is very important. They are very proud to bring the Virgin Mary back to her church every year. It is the pride of being Christians to be able to express love for Our Lady and Jesus. Everyone participates with great faith. It is good to think that the Madonna's encounter and her help so long ago in 1919 were not an isolated fact that ended up there. The Virgin Mary continues to accompany us. She is present in our lives at all times. A peculiarity of the 2017 edition of the event was the prayer for peace. Especially this year, the procession has a connection with Our Lady of Fatima for the centenary of the apparitions is celebrated. There, the Virgin Mary asked for prayers for peace, and that is what we did today. We asked for peace in the Middle East, Syria, Egypt, Iraq, and here in our country, the Holy Land.